YouTube. This is your boy Mr. B from Backyard Barbecue. Um, topic of discussion today is the 500, 500 subscriber, right? Uh, doing a giveaway. So be on the lookout for that. I think I'm at about 482 subscribers right now. First and foremost, I'd like to thank everybody that actually watched the video. Even if you're not a subscriber, thank you. It means a lot to me. It actually shows me that people actually, I ain't gonna say care, but are interested in uh, improving skills on barbecue or just seeing what other people are doing, man. I mean, I watch every, a lot of folks' videos too. You know, I'm subscribers to a lot of channels. Just showing the support, showing the love, man, because that's what it's all about in the end, man. Just showing the support. Uh, room for other people, man. You're in contests and stuff like that. I'm rooting for you, man. Uh, I personally don't have a favorite. Used to, but you know, his videos kind of fall off. I think it's. I think he's called Daddy Cooks or something. Uh, that was my man, man. He's a military dude. Uh, uh, I think he was in the Army or something, but still is. Anyway, give him a shout out. Appreciate your videos. You motivated me to kind of do this too. Actually, um, actually, I wish I had a video of a, a barrel grill that I made. I made a smoke out of a barrel grill. And of course, painted it uh, blue and orange, the Florida Gator colors. Then I gave it to my brother just because it was in the garage taking up space and I already had a Smoky Mountain Weber. So if you don't know what a Smoky Mountain Weber is, Google it. If you don't know what a, uh, or, or you can see mine too. Uh, if you don't know what a barrel grill is or how to make it, um, actually I got the tips from, like I said, uh, I forget what Daddy Cooks or something like that. So search him on YouTube if you want. It's up to you. But anyway, back to the topic. 500 subscriber giveaway. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to give away two products this time. Um, yeah. So if you're lucky enough to be the first person to comment on my video, this video, actually, no, if you're the, actually, let's do it like this. If you're the, the first and second person that actually comment on any video, as soon as I check and the 500 subscriber hits and I actually see that, it's kind of hard to just be sitting on the internet hitting refresh. I'm not going to do that. I don't think anybody's that crazy. Um, but after I hit 500 subscribers and I actually see that, um, the first two comments that I have, I will send those guys a product um, and I will actually do a video on that too um, to surprise them. If you don't know by now, you can look at my, I think, 100 subscriber. I think I did two, 250 subscribers. Send the product, man. They appreciate it. Um, actually send feedback. Shout out to those guys, uh, uh, the guy in New York. And I forget what the other guy is, but sending them their products, they love it, they receive the bear claws and uh, stuff like that. So trying to get creative with the gifts I get. Um, can't be too expensive because the wife be tripping over where the money goes, if you know what I mean by that. So I had to sneak stuff here and there and whatnot. But shout out to y'all, man. Like I said, I appreciate it. And be on the lookout, man. Uh, spread the word. Or maybe you want to hold on until after the 500 subscribers and then spread the word because somebody you refer to the website may actually win or maybe y'all can split the product i don't know so yeah like i said i appreciate the love appreciate the comments definitely i'm always the hip, uh, uh willing to help somebody out if they have a question about anything a lot of people ask me about the shirley fabrication smokers um I don't, I don't have a problem talking about it whatnot i actually talked to a couple guys and i don't want to say convince them but just gave them my input on the smoker hands down probably the best uh, stick burner I've had in a long time. Stick burner being burning wood. Uh, but I do have the option because I have the uh, the slide out rack where I can put charcoal in and cook with that or a combination of both or just straight wood. So, like I said, if you have questions, you think about getting any product that I have, man, um, like the slow and sear, I do videos on that. Um, and I don't really talk about the products anymore because ain't nobody paying me for this. And I feel like, uh, they're winning by me just giving my opinion, you know, live or whatnot. But yeah, if you hit me up, man, I'll comment below and just talk about anything. So don't feel free to do that. I have no problems with that. Um, I don't really like just talking about the same product all the time, like I said, because nobody has reached out to me. I know you see my videos out there. And no, I don't need money. Uh, but I would love some money if you want to give it to me. But um, a thanks would be nice. Or even send me some of your products and I do reviews on them, man. I don't have no problem with that. 
um, just to keep it out there, because I know y'all done made some money, especially Shirley Fab, man. I know y'all done made some money off me. Uh, I don't know if the people that actually purchased it actually say, hey, I saw a video on YouTube or whatnot. But like I said, man, I'm not in it for the money, but just show some love, man. I, you know what I mean? I mean, that common courtesy is what I call it. But anyway, I don't want to talk about that. We're here to talk about this 500 giveaway. So be on the lookout for that. It's coming up real soon. I'm averaging maybe one a sub, one or two subscribers a day, which is cool. I mean, it's steady. Um, numbers keep coming in. And I continue to make these videos, man, um, and put them out there for you guys. I try to stay consistent with it, it's uploading uh, every Sunday. I try to do uh, every Sunday, if I remember. I'm pretty pretty steady with doing, doing it. I used to do videos when I first started, if you don't know, uh, twice a week. But the thing with that is, by putting content out there twice a week, you kind of run out of things to do. Like, nobody wants to see leg quarters on every video, pull pork. So, you know, I got to be creative with this. So, I try to come up with things that you may or may not have seen and then uh, just bring it to you, man, live. I'm not trying to be like somebody else or look at somebody else's YouTube video and then just say, hey, that'd be a good idea to put on mine. That's called copycat. Now, at the same time, I may have sent a, uh, did a video that somebody else has done. I, but like I said, I don't just look at somebody else's video and then say, you know what, that'd be a good idea uh, to do it on somebody else's. No, it's whatever's in my freezer and I put out and throw out is what you get. Or some people have sent recommendations. Um, and I, I cook just because uh, uh, people have questions. And I would assume that if one person asks a question, maybe somebody else would like to know that same info. So that's what I do, man. So like I said, comment. I get back to you. I, I respond to every single comment, man. I just because I'm passionate about barbecue. Um, like my videos, subscribe. Um, you get more people involved with the uh, the channel and getting the good info out there, man. I do stuff raw and uncut. Like I said, this is a uh, backyard barbecue. At some point, I'm about to buy a, a, a smoker and put it actually in the backyard. I just don't want to pull out my Shirley Fab and roll it into the backyard because. One, my gate is not big enough for it to uh, roll through the grass because um, I got two gates. One to keep my dogs in and then I keep my trash in the other one. That way they're not going through it. So that's the only reason I, I don't take it all the way and just leave it in the back. Plus, I don't want it to uh, get exposed to the elements out here with the rust on it because I don't have a cover for it yet. But I think I'm going to take it back to Shirley Fab so they can uh, get me uh, a cover built for it. And I think it's a lady down the street from them. I need to ask them if they still build them. So you might want to ask that question if you're buying a Shirley Fab and smoking and you are uh, getting it built. Ask the question, man. I don't know what she charged, maybe $100, $200, $300, or whatever. Uh, but it would be well worth it if you plan on leaving it outside. So, like I said, be on the lookout for the 500th customer, or uh, subscriber, rather. And as soon as you see that, comment on any video because I get an email alert that lets me know. So when I check my email and it says a comment, I will actually show you on my computer. You know, I, I don't care. I don't know how pe other people do it. Don't really care. I'm doing it my way as my channel. Um, or if you got a better way for me to come up with uh, who the lucky winner is, send me a shout out, man. I might just send you something if you got a great idea. I'm easy, man. Like I said, so be on the lookout. It's coming soon. Uh, hopefully in the next, I don't know, two, three weeks. Uh, or if I'm lucky tomorrow or some, or some lucky subscriber tomorrow so be on the lookout for that and i look forward to continue to send these videos i'll let your boy but first don't forget to like subscribe comment below keep this show on the road baby we'll see you in a minute till next time mr b from backyard barbecue holla